Down for the Gators tonight. There's a look at six foot five, 225 pound Nick Pogue, the sophomore from Melbourne. The left at three miles an hour. And there's a five pitch walk issued to Tyler Martin, 15th walk of the year. And they call strike three, according to the first base umpire, Scott Klein. Yep. He went, got him to chase ball four. The 2 2 delivery hit in the hole for a base hit to right field. Tyler Martin will stop at second. So the Martins are aboard with first and second, one away. The old Mac. A swing and a miss on a big cut by Cabell, who also leads the ACC in strikeouts. A good weekend against Duke. Four for 11. First pitch, bloops one in the triangle. It falls for a base hit. A clutch two-out bloop single for Albert as Tyler Martin has scored, and the Seminoles take a one-to-nothing lead. For the season, 2.43, fifth in the league. Little squibber could be trouble. And on a close play, Pogue off the mound to get the job done. On the mound for Florida State, there's a look at Antonio Velez, 6'1", 212-pounder. Senior from Brandon via Hillsborough Community College. No wins, no losses, but a very fine ERA. He got him. No homers, five runs batted in. And a line drive singled into center field. So for the second straight inning, Florida State gets the leadoff man aboard. The pitch before. And he got him. Go Oppo. Another big strikeout by Pogue. Spanned four. All one strike on the FSU designated hitter. Rivera will make the long throw. And a nice stretch by Catalan retires the side. So Pogue pitched out of it. And now gets the walk. 17 game hitting streak. As Young trots to first base. He hits during his 59 starts. Slow roller right side. Jackson Green at second will throw him out to end the inning. No runs, no hits. Oh. Line to left. And Langworthy knocked it down and then recovers to keep Nelson at first base. But third consecutive inning. And the 2 2. Got him. That's popped up. Should be the final out. Kendrick Callalau squeezes it, and the inning is over. This ball right here. And he draws a leadoff walk. Just the second base runner the Gators have had, both coming via base on balls. And he picked him off first base. Nice move by Velez, who's doing it all right now. And there's strike three called. Very impressive three innings of work. As Velez walks off the mound, he's yet to give up a hit. Four off the mound. He said it's an unbelievable story. That ball is smoked down the left field line. It'll find the corner. Rolling all the way to the wall. Simmons will walk in with a double. And strike three called in the outside corner. And that'll drive a coach crazy. Double to left. Andrew DeSantis hit by pitch. Langworthy coming in near the line. Inning is over, and Tyler Nesbitt, a very happy Gator pitcher, leaving the mound. And he got him, swung right over the top of that pitch. Hitting 275. And that ball is smoked past Lacey, who reach the fence. McMullen will walk in with a double. Another ice. Up and in, swung at a ball for strike three. Ground ball to third. Here's Lacey, and he throws him out to retire the side. The, the game these two teams played here last year. Another base hit. Five for five, the Seminoles, in getting leadoff runners on base. 
And he dropped it right in there. Cabell with the hat trick. And strike three called. Back to back strikeouts by Nesbitt. Hit on the ground to Rivera. He'll make the throw across to Calila to retire Lacey. He did that in the first inning against Judd Fabian for F Florida AM. Flip a coin. Inning over. Tyler Nesbitt has had a very impressive stint in relief. After 31 years in a row, Nick Radio back then. And sure enough, the home radio booth just to our right is right behind the plate, and the television booth just a little off the center. The uh, the Seminoles played a uh, a split double header. They beat F and they played FAU, and then they played Texas Tech. Run on here. That ball is hit hard to left field, and it hits the wall. It's going to be an easy double for Matthew Nelson, his second hit of the game. In Florida State with runners on second and third and nobody out. Runs to one nothing lead here in the seventh. And a big strikeout of Robbie Martin. February 29th. And he's done it again tonight. Big strikeout again for Christian Scott. Now two out. And he did it. Three strikeouts after issuing a leadoff walk and then a double off the wall. And this crowd comes to its feet in approval, hoping the Gators can get on the scoreboard for a seventh inning stretch, trailing one cut up. Time up. And strike three taken over the inside quarter, 14 innings. A two to one win on Sunday, and now trailing one to nothing. Get off the fist, rolling in DeSantis. And safe at first base. Nothing game here in the last half of the seventh inning. And he got him. Have just the two hits. Back up the middle. Another leadoff base hit for FSU. Ace. That ball is hit out in the left center field. It's going to be a gapper. Simmons with his third hit of the night. 0 for 2 was hit by pitch. And he hits the first pitch to left. Langworthy going over will make the grab deep enough for Logan Lacey to tag and come on in. A sacrifice fly off the bat of DeSantis. Son Green. And got him on a breaking ball for the fourth strikeout of Green tonight. Ground ball out to Smith at second. And on to first. The inning is over in the game. Hit off the end of the bat. We'll sail it into right field for a base hit. Only the hit number three for the Gators. And he chased one up and out of the zone. Big strikeout for Parker Messick. Out here in the eighth. And he struck him out. And he got him swinging. Boy, the golden sombrero. And he will. There goes the runner. And it'll be no throw. And strike three at 92 mile an hour right down the chute. Got that. And a 1 nothing win in Jacksonville. But there is strike three swinging. Popped him up. Should be the second out. And the second baseman, Green, is there. Job Velez did. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Got him. The ball game is over, and the streak is over. Florida State snaps the Gators' 16-game winning streak to start the year and their 11-game winning streak against their rivals as they outpitch the Gators tonight in a 2 to nothing victory.